channel. My name is My Boy Gabe. Make sure to subscribe. We finally hit 150 subscribers. Make sure to subscribe. We finally hit 150 subscribers. 150 subscribers. This is the current lift on Rough Country. You can see the back sits way higher than the front. Like a good, I want to say like a two inch difference probably. See the. Hey, welcome to the channel. My name is Gabe, and today we're going to do an unboxing. We got some stuff for the front suspension build, some stuff that the community has advocated for. We are going to start with so, pretty much, we got some coilovers and some new springs. And I went the route that everyone suggests with the Bilstein 5100s. These things are adjustable ride height. Let's see what we got here. Oh man, these things are pretty. Wait till this thing fucking comes out. Wow, I love that finish on it. It's tough, it looks aftermarket. You got the three levels on here. You're able to uh, set the top one for 2.3 inches of lift. This is like 1.6 uh, or something like that. And this is the stock. Moving on to something pretty cool though. Found these on eBay. These are the tall springs that everyone talks about. Um, in the picture, it only showed these two colors, but they actually did take a measurement and post that they were 14 inches long. These were off of 2000. These are the tall springs. These are supposed to give you a one inch uh, lift from factory. I'll put these on here. Let's see how it looks actually. But again, still need to get my hardware because Bilstein likes to maximize their profits and of customer satisfaction. That thing's dope though. Pretty good lift right there. Damn. But yeah, gonna get this installed soon, but. Yeah. Well, today we are doing an unboxing video of some upper cone alarms for my Forerunner to actually get a real lift onto it. There you go. These are some Freedom Off Road. First unboxing. How to take some cool stickers. Probably gonna keep those. Put it on the window. Actually, I thought about the putting stickers on the window so they take your shit. Anyways, <laughs> there they are. These are it. Upper control arms bolts down into the into the control arm instead of it going up. Pretty clean. This is good for salty conditions because everything's sealed off. Not like the Uniball. It's just like a stock ball joint. Pretty cool. I'm gonna go get this installed. Bum, 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 Welcome bum. back to the channel. <laughs> I don't know. I always see YouTubers use that intro music. But anyways, here it is with the Bilson lift. I was just sitting here looking at it and I'm like, well, I can take a video. So Bilson 5100s with the, it's a 2000 model year uh, tall springs with some upper control arms from Freedom Off-Road with that. Uh, usually I do all the work myself, but shop gave me a good deal. There it is. I took a before video with the Rough Country. And there it is. It's uh, in the grass. It's a little uneven ground, but I mean, you guys are going to see more videos of this. So. I mean, it looks pretty good. Just got it washed. Yeah, I'm so excited. Like, honestly, the ride is awesome. I will honestly just take it for a ride and give you guys a review. Fuck. <laughs> I gotta do homework. I'm gonna do homework, but... Let me get that shot again. Oh, well, I could just mute it, but here it is. The geometry is good. The shock fits in there like a stock unit. Then the upper control arms made it fit even better. Yeah, this thing honestly drives like a brand new truck. And I honestly drives like as if it were on stock suspension, the way it handles and it's just a lot of control. No more wandering around on the highway. Uh, hits, honestly, I was at one point where I was like, how can a shock smooth out a bump like that? 
I was like, it's still gonna hit the body. How is it supposed to be much smoother? After getting this, I'm like, now I get it. There are shocks that can completely fade out bumps. Even bumps, I described this to my friend, went down a dirt road over here, but it's mostly just potholes. And I was like, you know, holes that I saw that I was ready to like get beat up for. Nope, this thing went right through it. Went right through it. Like as in like, like potholes that I was ready to really be um, beat up potholes that I was really gonna get beat up by this thing completely damped them out like I couldn't feel them I mean of course it's still gonna flex on like those big ones but honestly like those like rapid bumps I don't feel them this thing also with the rough country the front end like seemed like it bounced <laughs> whenever I hit a bump so sometimes it like steer weird or like honestly like it was feeling unsafe pretty much and after getting this, I, I have no problem driving it. It is a little, it feels like it's gonna roll, but I don't know, it almost feels like a communication between the two shocks when it's like leaning. One gets damper and the other one, uh, I don't know, it just really keeps level. It keeps it level, it dampens when you're going into the turn and it keeps it still instead of like, comp like with the rough country, I felt like it continually lean with it. It would continually lean with the truck. Like as, the more you get in the curve, the more it keeps leaning and leaning and leaning, little by little. But this thing completely, it leans and then it damps it like right away, and like even pushes it back onto the truck. It's pretty sweet. I'm also thinking I might need wide, some wider tires, but these things are new. But stability is a little, still a little on the weird side. I feel like. The truck's too tall now, so I feel like I need wider tires. Driver's side lean caused by the fuel tank. This one's a little taller, so this one goes on the driver's side, and that way it evens out the distribution of the weight, making it sit level. And all my name is my boy Gabe. Make sure to subscribe. We finally hit 150 subscribers. 150 subscribers. We made some playlists. Here's a Toyota playlist. Here's another Toyota playlist. Here's a Fox Body playlist. Here's a Land Cruiser playlist. Make sure to subscribe.